all right what's good dragon ball sparking zero fans welcome to the channel welcome to the video this is supreme black kai with the skooma drinkers i don't know why i said d uh, we don't even have that title but anyways what is this video about man well spark and zero for most people have been a lot of fun but what i want to really touch on is the bat and before people just start disliking the video or just trying to say that i'm hating um it is a very fun game i don't take it serious i don't take it as seriously like i would a fighting game but it's like a different type of fighting game and this is mindless fun i think that's all it was designed to be and that's okay uh so the whole debate on it being the serious game if you look at it from that lens then you could criticize the game differently than how you should in my opinion and how you should criticize the game is based on how fun it is and why i'm making this video and what the negatives are is can you really have fun or is everybody having fun and so instead of talking in circles like i am let me get to the point there's some glitches that literally ruin the game and yes we think oh they're going to fix it it's been a minute this game has been out for quite some time at this point uh it came out for everybody i believe thursday they released a day early and then you got the friday and then you got uh today even they had a day one patch and the fixes that i feel like are needed still have not been implemented but a lot of the fixes are kind of well this is an actual game mechanic and it's broken versus like an actual bug so the bugs is what we're going to focus on and by bugs i really mean singular bug there is a bug that has completely ruined the experience for a lot of people they can't even play online especially not on ranked and that bug is the bug to where if you are fighting somebody with standard controls and you are on the classic control so if you play tenkaichi and you want to go with those controls as opposed to the raging blast controls or whatever the standard is based off of you are fucked if you fight them and they're in player one position and there's different degrees to this shit even because i've talked to people and i've looked online and some people just have it to where the controls are swapped so you're just going to standard controls but your buttons are not swapped so essentially you just gotta do the supers the way that they intend you to do it on standard but the way i'm dealing with and what some other people are dealing with it will randomly change your buttons too and there's no way to check in the middle of your fight especially if you're online if your buttons have been switched the only thing that you can see is see that your layout is different between the standard and the classic and so even then that layout is not even accurate because for me that shit is not even the same buttons it, it doesn't work i'll be trying to do a fucking super attack and i'm doing something completely different it makes me do a vanishing attack or some shit i've had it to where my buttons are, are switched to where my right trigger is me fighting i have lost all of my ranked fights i have lost and i wish i could really show you guys all the stats but my game had to be reset because my game save got corrupted which is another glitch by the way that people has been complaining about i didn't mind it too much because i didn't do that much anyways i just bought some characters because with the ultimate edition you get more dragon ball so i just bought the zenny and then i just bought the characters it's the same exact thing i did this time around so i didn't lose too much but uh for the people who actually put a lot of time in the story mode they got fucked and it's very very unfortunate and there's nothing that they could really do about it so that's another really bad glitch um and it just kills the vibe of one to play but imagine having that glitch to where you anything you do offline is going to go away because it's going to get erased and anything that you do online uh you're going to have the 50 50 on you getting fucked apparently there's so many people who play on standard control i thought there would be way more tenkaichi players than people on the standard shit but uh, i am obviously wrong as fuck so and the hater and the evil and mean-spirited nigga in me is saying that uh, those niggas know that there's a glitch going on, so they're switching the standard on purpose. Uh, but that's just my headcanon. I don't really know for sure if you play standard and you're just playing standard to do it because that's what you're used to, power to you. But you are uh, fucking people over. Well, really, the game is fucking people over. It's not really your fault. Um, but with that being said, man, that shit is ass. Because, again, I've probably lost... 15 times and ranked out of the 50 matches that i did and 12 of those 15 times was off of some bullshit like this it was literally my controls being swapped and it just leads to me raging it leads to me thinking negatively of the game and i'm just waiting for a fix but it's been 
quite some time since the game came out, at least for the Ultimate Edition players. And then you got all the way to Saturday, which is two days after the game came out for everybody else. And the day one patch didn't really do anything for the most part. I don't know what it did, but definitely didn't fix this shit. And I don't see enough people talking about it. That's why I wanted to make the video. I've seen a video be made about it, but it's not enough videos being made. But this is game breaking and it's ruining whatever little competition is already on this game. Because not a lot of people are thinking super competitively of this game. But imagine if you do want to become that guy in this game and you're getting hit with this glitch. And again, like I said, some people have it worse than others. I don't know how bad I have it in comparison to other people, but again, my it's not just the layout being switched and I got to do supers differently, which that in alone is a huge disadvantage when you're used to doing something, especially if you practice and you lab all of your combos. But your buttons get switched too. And it is no warning or anything you don't know going into the fucking game. It's gotten so frustrating for me that I don't touch ranked anymore. I've been wanting to make ranked videos because out of the three people who work on this channel, and if you see us in the community at all on PC, you got Skuma Boy 1, 2, and 3. I'm one. I'm the worst out of the three. So for me being the worst, I would want to show my journey and getting better and everything like that those other two niggas are already killer and magic they're already sweats magic just won a 1k tournament today at the time of this re uh, recording he won a thousand dollar tournament so they're already sweats i'm not so i thought that would be the best content but i can't fucking do it i literally can't do it so it's holding me as a content creator it's holding me as a player uh, I'm sure I'm not the only one. I'm sure I don't have that the worst. There's people who literally said that they just straight up will not play the game until it fixes. Um, and those people are obviously the most hold because what can they do? There's people I've seen that's had the combination of both. The, like I said, the hypothetical situation earlier. Both of those glitches, those major glitches are, are happening to them. To where they can't do offline because their shit gets deleted. And they can't do online because of this glitch. So... I feel for y'all. I sometimes still get on and then I play a match and then sometimes I, I just run into a nigga who has some standard control and I immediately get off. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Like I said, I've gotten really frustrated if I run into a fucking standard player and they just start clapping me and I'm trying to do a, a, a vanish or anything and my controls are so fucked up. Because it's not every time. Sometimes it's normal controls. It's just the shit, the layout's different. Sometimes they change everything. I just turn my shit off. I literally just fucking dashboard and, and, and I quit. And maybe I'm a bitch for doing that, but it's too frustrating. It's way too frustrating. So they got to fix that shit. Again, this video was only to spread awareness on the situation. Um, hopefully you guys help in spreading that. Uh, this is not really a situation where I'm trying to garner views or anything like that. Watch our other content for that. We got a bunch of shorts. We got videos coming out. We'll try to do something. We're working on some shit to, to get some content out there to you guys, but this is not that kind of video this is if anything you take this video and you show it to people for the sake of hey i, I heard you've been dealing with this you're not the only one hopefully they patch it or whatever the case i don't fucking know. i don't know how that typically works it is what it is hopefully they fix it soon or people gonna fall out of love with this game really quickly at least the people who's dealing with this shit so uh that is the video guys thank you for watching this is scuba drinker signing out you guys have a great day